For the next 24 hours, moderate rainfall chances and moderate surf moving through the north as well as the east side. Vog levels should be low and those winds remain on the light to moderate end of the scale. Lots of leeward sunshine tomorrow with a few windward showers moving through. However, for Kauai, it's a different story as moisture starts to move through the Garden Isle as early as tomorrow and the rest of the state by Wednesday. Temperatures across the islands now 80 in Honolulu, 76 for Hilo, 77 for Kahului as well as Lihue. And it's hard to see on the satellite, but the sagging line of clouds right here, that is storm front remnants and that should be arriving over the island starting tomorrow. A timeline of this uh, increased moisture, as you can see, it's to the north. It's kind of moving south. It'll be over Kauai by tomorrow and then by tomorrow evening, transitioning to Oahu and then by Wednesday morning over Maui County. Wednesday afternoon, what's left of it will be over the Big Island. So with this, just a few more added clouds and showers. Some of those showers could be heavy at times, especially when they start hitting those mountains. In surf, or excuse me, uh, right now, just scattered showers tonight. Nothing that's very heavy. For all islands, those windward showers normally increase over the overnight hours. In surf, elevated surf for the east side, 4 to 7. We also have a swell for the north at 7 to 9 feet. Most likely, the east shores will be increasing. We'll probably see a high surf advisory in place by tomorrow for those east sides. So partly sunny tomorrow, light windward showers, of course, wetter for Kauai, and that surge of moisture moves through the islands completely by Wednesday morning. Overall, we're looking at nice trade wind weather conditions, a bit on the wetter side, and cooler weather sinks in around the Wednesday into the upcoming weekend time frame as the humidity levels drop. So a nice little cool uh, forecast looking towards the upcoming weekend. Joe, back to you.